How high can XRP go in 2019? Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco here and in today's video I'll be talking about Ripple XRP technical analysis and price prediction. So guys I look at the shorter time frame and do my technical analysis on it. Also guys I'll zoom out to the higher time frames daily, weekly, monthly time frames and do a bit more of a price prediction at the end of the video. So guys uh, I wanted to make this video because a um, few people commented saying that I should change my channel name to How High Rocco, or How High Crypto Rocco, because um, I've been making a lot of video about how high things can go. So I talked about Litecoin and Cardano especially, and I've talked about a few other coins as well. But I covered Litecoin from three months ago, and I kept updating videos on part one, part two. A few people suggested I should do it on XRP, so I thought I'll do it on XRP. So let's get into the video. Before I get in, guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. I'll do free content on technical analysis price prediction I also share about some of the coins that I'm looking to buy and um, so yeah keep, keep subscribed guys if you're interested in to stay up to date with this channel so guys let's get into the video so XRP guys has seen some nice price action and I mean it's not we've just seen some upside action and people are already talking about XRP is such a hype coin that any price increase gets people excited and recently we've not really seen this uh, we've seen one up move but we've not seen consecutive up moves as much so it's good to see that and we've made a higher high and a higher low uh, but what I wanted to see was hold this level when it got above this level I was expecting it to hold this level I even tweeted about a little scalp I took on my on our Facebook group where I talked about where I took it I posted the chart and I posted it again and um, I wasn't really I was a bit disappointed that it couldn't hold the level I was looking at but it, that's why it's important when you're trading in, in in the bear market when XRP is down the higher time frame it's important to take your profits so guys at the moment guys I'm looking at to see if it can break above kind of 33 level if it can't and it breaks down especially if it breaks down into this zone again it looks more like a an ABC you know corrective pattern rather than an impulsive move up so if we look at that guys it's not as good um, so we need to keep that in mind the four hour time frame is up but the daily time frame if you look at it it is still down guys we have to break above that kind of 32 33 level it's also the 50% level and kind of the one to one extension so we need to see price above this and it also breaks that um, the down the triangle I mean th this trend lines hasn't really worked that well in XRP It's broken a few times last year one of my best trades was the break of this trend line this year it hasn't really worked because it depends on how you draw the trend line so that is kind of what I'm looking at for XRP uh, one thing I did say was it has to hold this level it had to hold this level and good job it did hold this level so I mean I should make this video how low can XRP go rather than how high because XRP is not looking as good as some of the other coins. I'm sharing both my point of view and I'm sharing my honest opinion. I will make a video on XRP kind of fundamental. Fundamentally there's lots of stuff going on with XRP. I've been tweeting about it and I've post been posting it in the group as well. So maybe I'll make a video you know talk about both uh, the detailed video on the fundamentals. That video might surprise some of you so stay tuned for that. I'll, I'll be making that video in the over the next couple of days so one thing I did say was it has to hold this level it has to hold this level and it did hold this level which is good to see and it's seen some price action up but if if it can't make higher highs now guys um, if it can't make higher highs like that then it's going to be bearish because if the level gets tested again and then again it's more likely it will break and then if you go back to Bitcoin again I'm not making this comparison uh, to scare, uh, scare you all but if you see look at this sort of pattern where you know Bitcoin could not uh, could not get above could not move up and what happened was this level broke finally and XRP is given a similar sort of a pattern here so let's hope that that is not the case and uh, I'm not saying it is because it can easily break out higher which I'll talk about in my next video but you can see that it can happen as well so those are the two scenarios if it gets above this or maybe I'll look for a bullish position I have taken um, like I said in the uh, in I have taken a trade in XRP but if it breaks down below here guys I'll probably and uh, scratch that trade because I took a scalp long and then I'm still I've got another trade on as well so let's see if it can hold above this level those are two things on XRP guys so I've shared with the positive 
on what can happen and if it does go up and um, the, the targets let's go to the weekly to talk about targets my first target would be you know the break get getting above the 33 cents and if it can break above it uh the 35 cents there's some resistance there but the main zone if it does break above it would be the 40 cents for me and um, that will be a big resistance but i mean again i'll talk about uh, talk about the fund i just, just wanted to do a quick technical analysis not a detailed uh, ripple xrp analysis and um, last year we saw this big pump where it just literally broke through everything so can it happen again and all the zones that I'm drawing can it just break through everything it can happen it's a crazy market of cryptocurrency but I'm talking about both the scenarios so I hope you guys enjoyed that video I talked about some price targets guys I took a look to the shorter time frame what is your thoughts on XRP your honest opinion do you believe in this project fundamentally or you know technical analysis was what is your price target I'd love to hear your thoughts guys so comment below also guys like I said I've done an XRP giveaway previously in this video I think next I'll do a Litecoin giveaway because that it's been my best trade this year if you followed me uh, you should have made some money on it I'll be doing Litecoin giveaway guys if uh, when I reach my maybe 4,000 or 5,000 subscribers next so thank you very much for watching this video guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel turn on the notification button again these contents are all free guys I don't you know I do some mentoring if people are in, interested the free you know you can email me questions on technical analysis and price predictions and learning trading you can email me for a free 15 minute Skype call but you know th these YouTube videos are free I use my time so I'd really appreciate if you can help me out just by using the like button and subscribe button if, if this content ha ha have helped you and you think uh, I should make more Ripple XRP videos. So thank you very much. Smash that like button, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Go Ripple XRP!